Damn. I always, I always got to give myself some credit. Um, I feel like a lot. Of, I, I, you know, I don't watch very many other streamers, but every once in a while, I will. So here we go. Uh, we may end up losing some lives here, but it's all good. Surprisingly, oh, talk about like literally almost perfect, man. Like ten lives, seven lives. Who cares about that? And that's going to allow us to do a quick... I don't even think I want to rush this guy, actually. Let's see how much money he's going to make over here. I mean, I'm spending a lot of money on this thing. He's got a mortar strat. Oh, we're going to switch into black balloons now, now that he's got the mortar. So we can overwhelm him just a little bit over here with our weirdo combo rush, basically. Farm-wise, we're pretty even. Eco-wise, probably pretty freaking even here. But we are causing at least some problems with our nice black rush right here. He's got to pop down a ninja in addition. He's going for... Oh! He's going to go for the balloon trap ninja strategy. Now, this is sort of an off-the-wall, off-the-beat strategy. I kind of appreciate this. Um, it, it is good, though. It's not a bad strategy whatsoever. Here we go. A pretty sizable yellow rush coming out against me here. But pretty sizable pink rush coming out against me here. But again, I think I can defend here. I think. Here's the monkey bank. White rush is coming out against me now. We're going to pop down an extra one of these guys. Powerful darts. We got the bank of flowing for us, and we do end up defending. Oh, did we lose zero lives there? No, two lives. Doesn't matter to me, dude. And here we go. Banana Investments Advisory. A little on the late side there, but at least we got it going, dude. Is a random camo lead rush. It's difficult to defend. Uh, you can do a couple whites underneath this thing sometimes, and sometimes it can cause problems. But he's got the mortar. He's trying to pop that thing down. Uh-oh. Lightning bolt's a little on the late side there. He loses about... 50, about 40 lives so far. Okay. You know what? I think it's worth a try again. Why not? It's not that expensive of a rush. So I'm down. I'll try it out. And uh, he's got a 2 3 ninja this time around. Looks like that should be enough for him. But what about a Moab class balloon, man? Can he defend that? Oh! Any more lives? Oh, I saw him go through. I was really hoping. We'll see how it goes. A couple camel eyes underneath there. What is he going to do against this thing? This is a pretty beefy rush right here, guys. He slurped up a lot of those balloons, but he's still... Oh, he's going to damage boost. He's going to counter me, though. Can he defend on his side? Much oh, and he doesn't defend on his side. I was going to pop a Tesla coil down for those lead balloons, and maybe a damage boost on it in addition to that. But holy crap, dude. We take him down right there. Moving on to the quarterfinals. Quick uh, attack your start. Defeats, like, almost everything, surprisingly. Don't know how, but he does. He's amazing. And, uh, oh, my God. Blade shooters, dude. You can stop full out yellow balloons. I don't need to do anything too crazy. You know, I don't even care that much about the lives. I really want to hope that... I really hope that I can fit three farms down here, though. I might have messed it up somehow, and... I don't know. I'm hoping that I can fit all three. So we go, we're going to go spaced uh, uh, combo balloons up in here. We're going to see if we can end up getting our farm before he does, hopefully. Come on, one more banana. Give me one more banana. There it is. There's at least two farms down on the screen here. He's going eco fire. So are we. So we got to go... Uh, quick blade show oh, crap. Oh, crap. There we go. We get Blade Shooter over here. Now we're looking good, though. All right. Now it's going to be unlikely for just about any rush for the rest of the game to actually kill us. Where, for him, he's going to have to start defending pretty hard. Oh, I thought I bought that already. Oh, I bought the... Oh! <laughs> I done goofed here, guys. I bought the right-sided farm upgrade. I knew I bought something. I bought the right-sided 1-0 farm upgrade, which is, by the way, not that expensive, which is good. It's only like 250 bucks or something, but it still just kind of sucks to have it happen, you know? Late game, I'm going to rely on the submarines a lot, actually. I think that might be the best thing for me to do. Hopefully. Oh, here we go. We got regen whites. I think I could take these things down, though, man. Even if it costs me like a couple lives. Yeah, whatever. Whatevs. That's going to allow me to get my third tier banana farm, and then I can counter rush this guy as well right after that, because now... Uh, he wants to get the same thing I got. Now he's like, oh, crap, Chris, you're, too, oh, you're doing so freaking good over there. Like, I'm j <gasps> He got a little faster than I thought, though. Regen lead. Pinks or we're yellows? Pinks or yellows? Pinks or yellows? We're going... Let's go yellows to start. I'm going to switch into pinks here. And I'm actually going to stop there, though, because I don't think I'm going to kill him here. I'm just trying to cause as many problems again. And we get a pop boost out of him. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Now, the greed is going to be real here, guys, because we're going for our second third-tier banana farm already. Uh, oh, pop boost is still in action here. Um, the reason why blacks is because the sniper did... Oh, crap. Double lightning bolt on my side. He's struggling. Looking. Arnett shots. Will he lose here? He gets a destroyer up in the... Oh, yes. 
There we go, baby. There we go. We take him down with the Black Rush. Sick, nasty plays right there. Uh, basically, what we wanted to do is we wanted to kill him with something that the sniper couldn't pop. So I was thinking zebras were too powerful. We went for black balloons instead, just trying to overwhelm him, you know? All right. Uh, he's got red balloons flying out. E oh, he does have eco amplifier. Oh, he just used it like before the game even freaking started. Before I was even in the freaking game. Is that what just happened right there? Well, of course he did. Well, of course he did. So he's going to go for a, a double farm start here because he's going for the balloons in addition to all this. I don't know. I guess that's fine. I suppose that's acceptable. Perfect pink rush from him, too. Somehow, Tachiter not taking these pink blooms down. How is that even possible? Here we go. Full out pinks. Full out pinks. Last eco amplify. And that's going to hopefully give us our 2 0 farm over here. There we go. And I'm going to keep on flowing with these guys, though. He's got a good strat, though. You know? I mean, look at these positionings, dude. Perfection. He's a dart player. Oh, he's a dart player. No, no, no way that Black Bloons are going to get through my freaking Blade Shooter here. Unless my positioning is just that god-awful. It is. It is that god-awful, guys. I'm losing the Black Bloons here. This is garbage. <laughs> I, I put it down there because I thought it was going to be good against the Bloons kind of leaving over here. Because I didn't know if he had Salty Wounds or not yet. But now that I look back at it, oh crap, dude. We screwed up. I can pop down just one more low-level Dart Monkey. That should be enough here. Or not Dart, but Tack Shooter. <clears throat> Lightning bolt this time. <laughs> All right. All right, dude. Round nine here. He's going to rush me. Um, I will tank it. Whatever. We're tanking it, boys. We're tanking it. Not too bad. Could have been worse. Losing about 40, 50 lives here. We got another yellow rush coming against him. He, I don't know. I don't know. There we go. Two lightning bolts down, though, dude. That's not bad at all. We're going to pop our quick mortar up in here. All right. So it looks like this is going to be a pretty easy one for him. Um, probably. A bunch of black balloons, though. Not easy to take down, especially when they start to overwhelm these zero three 3 dart monkeys. So we just go basically all out here with our zero threes 3s right now. He's losing lives on 80, 70. Uh-oh. Going to use a testicle or what? He's got to, dude. Come on. 60s. He's in the 50s. He's in the 40s. Drain him! drain -omatic. And we get so many lives on him there, but we do not take him down. We have 800 income, but he's got that bank over there. So he's going to be... Uh-ohs. I think he's trying to get the life advantage on me, or what? I don't even know. I really don't know what he's trying for. But, uh, realistically, a mo <sighs> He's got dart monkeys, dude. Dart monkeys are so hard to get anything through. Alright, we pounded him down his throat there. We had used two testicles to survive. <laughs> I didn't even see what the heck was going on on his side, though. But we are indeed alive, my friends. That's good news. All right, plus we got a Maelstrom here. We can work with him as we see fit. But uh, BFB play is definitely going to happen over here, guys. Definitely going to happen. Both of us are probably going to rush with BFBs, actually. There we go. There it is, man, as expected. So let's go for... Just a few of these guys. He's got Spike Factories. I'm going to damage boost it. I don't feel like dying here. Damage boost! We take it down. He takes it down. Um, pretty wild ride from both of us here. Now, I've got... I don't know. I don't know if this is a good spot or a good idea or anything. But I did it anyways, all right? Here we go. Second BFP coming out. Now we try the regen leads. Couple leads. Couple regen leads. Couple regular leads. Keep him occupied over there. He's going to try and Super Monkey Fan Club this. We're trying to overwhelm him here. Overwhelm like crazy, man. He's going to go for the grounds here or what? He's going to damage boost it, though. He damage boosts and annihilates this stuff. Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. Scary stuff's here, man. Scary stuff. So we're going to pile up another BFB against this guy right after the damage boost is gone. Plus, I'm struggling against the balloons here for sure. 
Another regen led rush. Plus, I'm gonna pop my second mortar down over here. So we're gonna go for a left sided mortar this time. Super Monkey Fat Club pops out. Looks like it's gonna be good enough. The lead balloons just can't sneak through, guys. They cannot sneak through. Um, now, uh, what I would like to remind you guys is that we both have to kill each other. I mean, really, realistically, he's gonna have to kill me here, I think. I don't know how easy that's gonna be for him. Is he trying to get rid of my road spikes here, or what? I don't know. Um, we could counter with our, our own zone, my god, here if we really feel like it. Uh, and we could just see how it goes down, because we only got 27 rounds total, so let's keep this guy busy. I've got t roughly $20,000 to work with over here if I want to. And we're going to hope that our Blade Maelstroms are just going to be unbelievably super-duper powerful over here with our damage boost. That's what we're really relying on. See how good this does, though? Spike storms and stuff are definitely possible over here. Uh-oh, though. All right, so we got to sell this thing for sure. Here's a Blade Maelstrom, Blade Maelstrom, Blade Maelstrom. We're going to go for a big one as well. In addition to all this. All right, damage boost time with some Maelstroms. Slowly unload, guys. Slowly unload the Maelstroms. And there they are. And we do defend. He had to struggle against defending on his side, too. But now I only got one damage boost left. He's going to try and rush me with some weirdo balloons. I'm up on life. He's got to kill me here on this round. Uh-oh. I mean, he's definitely got a chance here. All right. Let's do it. Boom, 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 <laughs> Look at those damage-boosted Maelstroms, though, man. Camel Pigs, though, uh, actually not a bad idea at all, to be honest. Holy crap. He almost got me on lives there, man. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. No, I just gave you guys that slow release, didn't I? Oh, it felt so good. Kevin, man, I... I Again, it's just, it's one of those things, like, who had the better late game towers right there? And, like, if the game went on forever, you would have won. Guaranteed. Ground Zeroes, dude, over my crappy mortar attack shooter strategy. But good game overall, man, and we make it to the finals. Lives are not super duper important here. So, it looks like we can easily go for a quick heli here to start. Oh, he's going Darling Gun. I think he wants to show off against me, man. Alright, we're gonna get super greedy here, guys. Eco Amplify, ba bam, another one zero. We're going boom boom start. What? Chris, you crazy! You can't do boom boom starts! You can't do no boom boom start! That doesn't work! We actually are gonna go for the heli pilot start, actually. I, I just wanted to screw with you guys a little bit. Now what we can do is we can actually sell this guy for now, get our last Eco Amplify flowing, and we get our 2-0 farm up here right basically at the exact same time as him. But his defense is better. That's something you got to keep in mind here, guys. His defense is 100%. 1,000% better. Let's go for our Ice Tower over here. We're going to go Permafrost as well, just so we can slow down these balloons. So for the rest of the game, we can just sort of slowly take these guys down. And we're going for our yellow rush here. All right, even on farms, what's he going to do? Ooh, he's got a yellow rush coming against me, though. We're going to have to do the same thing, man. Test the coil. All right, we're going to keep on going with it, though. Another yellow rush flying out. He's going to get cannon. He's got cannon dartling gun. Really? Now, that's an interesting combo. Losing a lot of lives over here, but do not lose the game. At least not yet. Going for an extra Dartling Gun here to defend against these Black Bloods. He's got to get them Blacks pop right away. Otherwise, that third tier can is going to be basically worthless here. Um, pretty sizable rush coming against him here. I mean, mostly we're just going for income. He's going to go for a third tier banana farm in addition to all this. So he's got that money's going in here. I cannot believe that his Dartling Guns are popping every single one of these Black Bloods that I'm sending out against him. That's just so weird to me. How is he able to do that? Same thing. Same thing, man. Very interesting. All right. Well, I think it's about that time, guys. We need to start greeting a little bit. Let's get some farms a-flowing. Basically, at all. He's going to go for the fourth tier banana farm already. All right. That means I've got to rush. Of course, it has to cool at the very least. I can't believe that that's defending. I just don't understand how he's getting that stuff. You know? Like, what? What? 
how are those Dartley Guns hitting those balloons so reasonably amazing? I don't get it, bro. I don't get it. The Overwhelm looks like it's kind of taking over here. But it's not taking over. And he's still got that fourth-year banana farm. Holy crap, guys. I mean, we're switching to basically blue income right now instead of farm income. But he's got that huge lead in the long run here. I'm down on lives. This is just uh, a bad situation for us to be in at this point. Two testicles. There's my last two testicles. No damage boost required, though. Um, he gets a fourth tier cannon to defend. Ho ho ho! Nicely played, dude. Let's uh, let's slow it down here. We're gonna get rid of this guy. We're gonna go regen. Camo leads underneath this thing. He's going big, big balloon buster. Holy crap! Regen camo leads though. Oh baby, regen camo leads. He's got a lightning bolt in addition to all this crap. Oh, snap. Really close game over here, guys. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. If you're wondering why am I not popping the BFP, I'm trying to get as many towers on the screen as I possibly can here to defend this thing. Thinking about getting a quick turbo charge here. If I can afford it. All right, there's the turbo charge. There's my damage boost. We're going to turbo charge through this thing. We should survive here, but um, definitely farm-wise, he's got a pretty gigantic mega lead on us right now. Um, let's just say that it's going to be difficult for me to try to keep up with this guy at all. Oh, no! Oh, no, 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 no! Fairly intriguing rush from this guy. I don't need the turbo charge anymore. We're going to go for the slowdown here automatically. Let's get rid of him right away. Um, and it looks like the best play for me to play right now is actually to get a quick Apache dart ship, I think. Um, all right. Here we go, guys. Another damage boost with a turbo charge and hopefully a second turbo charge over here. Hopefully... Second turbo charge flying out right now. And against these balloons, baby, with double turbo charge flying in and a damage boost, we do defend. But oh my goodness gracious, baby. We got to go, oh my god, over here hard on this guy. He's trying to do a lot of insta kills over here right now. We're going to slow it all down here. Ba bam. Slow it all down. Keep it on the screen. I've got no income left, guys. Literally nothing. <laughs> the only thing that I've got left is one silly little 3-0 boomerang and a damage boost! Will it be enough, though? I have no freaking idea here. Oh, my God. Round 27, the last round of the game here, guys. Can he take down his... Oh, my God. It's looking pretty good for him to kill me here with these MOA brushes. But, oh, my God, are Apache Darts him still defending? Go, Apache, go! And I got enough money for one last Moab. And one last Ice Tower. Permafrost them balloons, baby. Permafrost them balloons. No! No, the Moabs are gonna take me down here! Oh, such a good game, but we're gonna end up losing here at the very end of round 27, man. G to the G, baby. G to the G. That was good. That was a really freaking good game. Honestly, like six minutes of nonstop rushes back and forth, left and right, Caleb. I really loved that game. All right, I got to be straight with you, man. I loved the rushes back and forth. I loved the action-packed gameplay right there. That was a fun one, dude. So uh, overall, good game from both of us, but you took me down in the end. Wonderful. And I got to admit, without using ninjas or ice towers either. So great game, dude. G to the G.